Hello everyone. We are going to discuss the first three problems in this video. The first problem is we have n notes of 2000 and we want to pay the same amount using 5000 uh, 500 notes only. So how many notes will be needed? So uh, to, uh, total amount is n into 2000 and we need to find the number of 500 notes. This. So returning 4 into n will be our solution. So we can simply return t into 4 and this should do this. Now the second question is best of 2. So here we have 3 <coughs> each player gets 3 chances. They turn a dice and the score of a person is the sum of the two highest rolls and whoever scores the highest will be the winner so we have a1 a2 a3 b1 b2 b3 we can sort them so after sorting if they are a1 a2 a3 b1 b2 b3 now we take the sum of a2 and a3 because this will be the maximum elements after sorting so now we will sum a2 a3 b2 b3 now if this is greater than allies wins if equal then tie or in the last case bob means when b1 b2 plus b3 is greater than a2 plus a3 so that was it we take the input we sort both the arrays and we just apply three conditions in fields and that does this job now the third question is uh, it is related to somewhat cryptography so uh, here what we are given are we are given three strings a b c we are given three strings now uh, we have shifted some by some integer k uh, characters of a into b and we want to shift using the same integer string c so how can we do this so now we know that a string is uh, converted into b by shifting k right so every character will be shifted so we can just take the first character of a and first character of b and if we minus this uh, let's say this gives us some difference d so this is it this will give us the different between the <coughs> difference between the values of this now this can be negative for example if we convert a b into uh, what can we say okay so for this to be negative we can convert it as b converted into a now if we see it seems like uh, it's getting negative so to shift it back to positive we can add plus 26 so that uh, the difference will get back to positive and we can easily compare so now uh, by this so we calculate the difference d by this and if d is negative we add 26 now we got our k this d the d will be k this is our k by which we are shifting it now to simply shift the characters of c so we will simply add this d now this can get greater than 26 right so we just need to apply modulus so it will always remain between a to z and this will give us our required output so
yeah so this is the code uh, we calculate the difference if difference gets negative we add 26 then we just append the character plus difference and we convert it into the char and that gives our required string so these are the first three problems if you have any doubts or want further clarity you can comment below thank you